Every new idea, every bold leap forward, every new treatment, and every life saved because of medicine started by asking a question. Cardiovascular research has come a long way in a short time, but we still don't understand everything, and there's much we can do to better help patients if we seek answers to the right questions. At the University of Michigan Cardiovascular Research Center, we ask and find answers to those big questions. We're trying to develop safe treatments and medications that can decrease blood clots without causing risk of bleeding. I'm trying to find a way to manage patients with acute aortic dissections. I'm trying to understand arterial diseases. I'm trying to find the ability to prevent sudden cardiac death. I'm trying to understand why people who start doing exercise, they suddenly drop that. How can a single gene mutation behave so differently in different people, even within the same family? I am trying to cure atrial fibrillation. Fibromuscular dysplasia. Cardiac arrhythmia. Hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. Our dream is to get rid of diseases. It's a really exciting time to be in research, and I think um, with all the technology that's now coming on board, um, we just have some really unique opportunities um, to move science forward and move it to the clinical arena. Simple insights and major breakthroughs can come from seemingly unrelated inspiration. That's why we strongly believe in collaboration at the University of Michigan. Working side by side and together, our project teams harness the diverse knowledge, skills, and creative energy of every researcher to find answers. Collaboration is key because nowadays the technologies, the approaches in biology and in medicine are so complex that you cannot do anything by yourself. The uniqueness of the research at the CVRC is that it's a team science, team medicine. A team effort involves biologists, uh, uh, physiologists, mathematicians, uh, computer scientists, cardiologists, uh, and uh, people who are interested, all of them, through different pathways on the same question. In terms of human potential, we have uh, individuals who are at the top of their specialty knowledge uh, in just about every specialty in cardiovascular disease. You just have to go down the hallway to find one of the world experts in any type of research or any type of technology. We complement our treatments by I do this part, you do the other part, whatever we do best. And, uh, and I think this translates into an immense benefit to the public wizard. I mean, people here care about each other. They want to work together. They reach out to you. Um, and everybody that I've ever spoken with is so receptive to working together uh, to answer a question. You can start to ask bigger questions. Uh, the scope of your research expands tremendously. The atmosphere at the CVRC is simply awesome because we are all very excited to be in a fantastic place, in an amazing university, and in a place where collaboration is possible. We come to work every day. Uh, we do the science, we do our homework, we design the effective and right experiments so we can get test compounds and drugs to the clinics and to these patients as quickly as possible. So everything is possible as long as you put your minds to it, as long as you put resources into it, and as long as you have the support of the community. Patients are waiting for that, for that answers and, and, and we are working very hard in order to provide them. Our patients really need these answers to help us come up with better ways to care for them. I believe in creativity in medicine and in biology. I believe that any science or any human activity that does not progress forward is meant to disappear. I see an enormous drive in order to be at the forefront of everything. Our goal at the University of Michigan is to think big, that we want to answer those hard questions, uh, and we ultimately want to get as close as we possibly can to curing disease. 
And I am very excited because I feel that the technologies of tomorrow, the treatments of tomorrow, are developed right here at the Cardiovascular Research Center. The research we do may not help patients today, but at the University of Michigan, we're asking the big questions. Tomorrow's answers start here.